I didn't have to take anything out of my bags, nothing. Just put it in the tray and let it slide through, no problem. I'm like really early, so I don't know exactly what I'm gonna do. Gate I'm standing at right now that I'm supposed to be at is going to Dallas-Fort Worth at one o'clock, but my flight isn't until 2.50, so I gotta find somewhere to sit. I don't really mask up too often now as much as I should, but uh, considering my girlfriend got COVID the last time she was in an airport, I'm playing it safe. Got a pot belly sandwich. My first time ever having one of these. Flying out to Rochester today. A couple of firsts for me. Uh, for one, it's the first time I'm flying post pandemic. Also the first time I'm ever flying by myself too. Every time I've been on a plane, which has never been that often in my life, in my nearly 23 years of living on this planet, I've always been accompanied by at least one of my parents. So uh, this is a nice big first for me. I feel like I'm adulting more and more as the days go on. Some Swiss in there, lettuce, tomato, onions, mayo, avocado, of course. I'm gonna take a bite of this. It's on some whole wheat bread. That is pretty good. That's actually really good. That was a really good sandwich. Little update time. These masks, they always have, wire always comes out of these. I'm gonna see if I can keep it in there as long as possible. So I had to move gates. Like they were just like, oh, it's changed. You have to go over here. I had to go through basically a whole different side of the airport. I was like, wow, this is a, a lot different. It seems like this side of the airport is more still in construction than the one I was originally at. And I also got delayed by like nine minutes, but I'm sure I'll make that up in here. It's not too bad of a delay at all. We will be leaving shortly. Please step out of the aisle to allow others to pass by. Please take your sights quickly at us. Sights quickly and safely. So I, I forgot to do the uh, the vlogging part of the vlog after I got here yesterday. Wasn't really much going on though. We uh, went to Walmart, got some food. I also got this Goku action figure because I have a Piccolo one like it at home and I wanted a Goku to match it. So that is a Rochester souvenir. After that, we went to a friend's house to have some food and then we came back here, settled in for the night. This morning, uh, my girlfriend made some breakfast, spent the last couple hours editing a review of Arthur the King, which is out now on my channel. And uh, in a little bit, we're gonna go back to Walmart because we gotta get stuff to make dinner for tonight. We're having some chicken burrito bowls. Hi, Mama. <laughs> She's like, what is this device? What is, what is this? What is this thing? Just staring out into the wilderness, which is a car. We're at Walmart again, picking out stuff for the for the burritos. Any chicken breast? Nice little nice. Weight Watchers recipe here. So now I'm at Wegmans because uh, we forgot guacamole. I don't think Walmart had it anyway. I just gotta find where the heck it is. Check it out, we got chicken, we got lettuce and cheese, we got the onions. We're gonna have some good burritos. Look at this. Yeah. Okay. We got them beans in here. I think that's perfect actually. Oh yeah. I think it's perfect. I, I underestimated. You underestimated the oh. beans. Tops water. Sucks. Disgusting. But like. There's some upstate shit right here. It's disgusting. Why are you gonna do that? 
thought about it, I stopped myself. You did make a lot of chicken, so we'll have a little bit extra. Okay, okay, okay. You cooking it up. You cooking it up. All right. <laughs> Look at that. A little scrump, diddly umptious. Gotta have a little bit of it. How is it? Mm. It's good. Perfect amount of spice. No, 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 no. That's a nice chicken right there. Put the cheese on there. It's looking, it's looking great. It's looking great. Look at these, look at these. We made four of them. Isn't that great? Test, taste. Taste, test. Test, taste, review. You really are dyslexic. <laughs> That's some good chicken. Mm-hmm. Mm. We mm. did that. We made that. We made that. I think I have a new favorite recipe, damn it. Seriously, this is really yeah. good. Yeah. I wonder how it would be when we make our own guacamole with it. Mmm. We'll have to find out. Good morning. <laughs> he kicking his feet. We are dog sitting Louie this weekend. It was a nice little surprise for me because I had no idea until he got there. Come here. Oh, you good puppy. You good boy. Yeah. Let it all out. All their puppy frustrations in life. Hello. Hello. Hi. Oh. Oh. Hello. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Okay. <laughs> She's on top of me. Hello. What are you doing? Ah. Oh, ah. <laughs> Get off. Get off. Get off. Thank you. <laughs> Good afternoon. We are getting ready to go. We're going to see a movie. We're going to see Immaculate, the new uh, Sydney Sweeney <laughs> horror movie. She's very excited about seeing Sydney Sweeney on the big screen. So uh, that review is probably out by the time you're watching this. So uh, go check it out. After that, we're gonna hit up a Goodwill. I've actually never been to a Goodwill before. There's like one Goodwill on Long Island and I still haven't been to it. And it's like not even a 10 minute drive. I should really do that. But there's a Goodwill here. So I figured I might as well take a look at it before I can't in the sense of I'm leaving here in a couple days. She's not happy that I'm leaving, but uh, I must, I must go back to my home. Don't worry, you're gonna see me in a month. Mm -hmm. Long distance uh, is, is interesting. It's worked. She likes to bite my arms. Ended. We just saw the movie Immaculate. Oh, it was somewhat immaculate. <laughs> if you want to see my review on the movie, be sure to check out the video that's probably already out by the time you're watching this. That movie looks awesome. I can't wait to see that one. Holy moly. That's the freaking Kodak Tower. That was like the greatest Pitbull lyric of all time right there. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I'm about to enter a Goodwill for the very first time in my life. I don't see Titanic. Where's Titanic? Yeah. Oh shit, they gotta let it shine. 
I might actually buy this. Okay. I've never seen this one or the second one. You uncultured swine. I'm sorry. Everyone said it was a Toy Story ripoff, so I was like, I'll wait till it's on streaming, and then I never watched it. <gasps> oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I used to have this on DVD, and I've been wanting to reacquire it. I think I'm gonna do that today. Pooh's Heffalump movie, bro. Oh, that's exciting. I think I'm good with just these today. We're back uh, at the residency now. We're having like uh, leftovers from last night, plus a mix of some sweet potatoes in there too. I'm about to lose my twilight virginity. We actually started watching this back in December, but then just never finished. So we're gonna do that and it's gonna be a complete run through. I don't know what team I'm on because I've never seen any of them. Twilight was always one of those things that all the girls in school talked about. When I was, it came out when we were in like third grade. There's five of these. Wow. Wish me luck. Good morning. It's a new day. It's, it's Sunday. I go back tomorrow. We're going to IHOP. Uh, apparently there's some Sonic the Hedgehog stuff on the menu. I don't know if it's at this IHOP specifically. If there is something, uh, you know damn well I'm gonna try it. After that, we're going to the laundromat. She's got laundry to do, and I figured I'd just do mine. We're gonna do Paint by Numbers, which is a gift that my aunt got her for Christmas and her birthday. It's a sunflower, and it is very detailed, which is why it takes yeah, a Yeah, I looked at the thing and I'm like, Jesus Christ, this, <laughs> is, this is gonna be a process. We did like three numbers, and it was like two tiny, like... Yeah very small fragments of a bigger canvas. So we're gonna do that and then we'll call it a night. Taco Bell right here. This shit has no personality. I really hate modern minimalism, bro. We're back. We're back. Uh, so we went to the laundromat. Uh, IHOP took very long. There was like hardly anybody there. They might have been short staffed. I don't really know, but we were there for about two hours. We're gonna do a paint by numbers now. Like, actually do it this time. Yeah, we like started it a couple nights ago and then I got really tired. It's very complicated. As you can see, this is what we have so far. It is complex. my last day here. This was inevitable. This is what got done in regards to the paint by numbers. We made a lot more progress from uh, where we started yesterday. Obviously we weren't gonna finish it because this shit is so detailed and intense, but that's okay because uh, we can save it for either the next time I'm here or she's gonna work on it while I'm back home. I can give you guys like updates and stuff. That'll be fun. As the day goes on, we'll just chill. And then when the time comes to go to the airport, we'll go to the airport and I'll do all that fun stuff. And then uh, I'll make my way home. All packed up. She's not happy that I'm leaving. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I have to go. She was just meowing at me. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Oh, she turned her head in disappointment. She's, she's not happy with me. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. 
this, my friends, is the back of a Taco Bell. You can tell because they have these things here. And that's the back of a drive through thing. This is Hannah. Her eyes are closed. Sun. Because the sun. Ah. Got a taco. This is the chicken cantina burrito. She's trying to replicate the seven layer that they used to have. And then we got some guac and some chips. I keep them in the bag because they're spilling out. Chicken cantina burrito from Taco Bell. I tried the quesadillas already and they were amazing. So we're gonna try this now. Yeah, that's the stuff right there. That's great. That is so good. I love this. It's amazing. Give it a try. Right? Mm -hmm. Right? Delicious. Delicious. Goodbye. Love you. safe and sound my friends i came home to a uh, bit of a mess my brother was home from school this weekend i did miss him this time around hello brian i love you and i miss you i also got some mail uh none of this is wish list stuff but uh, if you would like to send me something from the wish list the link is down below Obviously, I don't expect anybody to, but it is there if you'd like to do it. So if you do, thank you. I'm going to save these for uh, the next time, though, because uh, this video is probably long enough as is, and uh, I don't want to get too off topic. Let me just uh, take this bag off. I don't know why I'm still wearing it, even though I'm seated. Before I end, I just want to say thank you to everyone who has continued to watch my stuff over the last, I don't know, good while. Honestly, probably the last, like, five, six years especially. I've been pretty inconsistent with content and I'd really like to fix that. I tried doing a podcast for a bit. I've been doing a lot of stuff on TikTok, which has done really well for me. That's not going anywhere. In a perfect world, I would like to balance the content I create for both YouTube and TikTok. So hopefully I can do that for you all. If you're watching this video and you haven't followed me on TikTok, you should do so. The link is in my bio. It's at Jimmy Mullen, the same as my YouTube channel. I've been live streaming my physical media collection over there and it's been a lot of fun and I plan to continue to do that. That's what a lot of this mail is over here actually. But like I said, we'll save that for next time. This is gonna be the first of uh, many new videos here on the channel. I'm looking to go back to my roots, at least with this channel. I mean, I've been making content for well over a decade, almost 14 years actually. But in regards to the content I made in high school, vlog style content, I would like to kind of bring that back in full swing and uh, I would love for you guys to check them out as they come out. So uh, with that said, I hope you enjoyed this little trip through Rochester. I had a really great time. It was great to see my girlfriend. And yeah, thank you for watching and I'll uh, see you next time.